How interesting a scene. Well, before the 1960s, Chinese food in the United States was relatively unheard of, a bastardized version of the authentic. Now, the tipping point came when, in 1961, the now 94-year-old Cecilia Chiang opened a restaurant in San Francisco. A documentary on her life has been tooted over the weekend at the South Beach Wine and Food Festival in Miami. Let's meet the chef herself. How old are you? I came here... Meet the top chef who brought authentic Chinese food to America. 94-year-old Cecilia Chang is at the South Beach Wine and Food Festival in Miami for a documentary centered on her journey to the country. Chang still remembers Chinese food in the U.S. when she first arrived. Uh, pretty bad. It's all chop say. And uh, that's really not Chinese food. Yeah. And so at that time, I, something in my mind, I decided I really have to do something, try to educate the American and tell them what is the real Chinese food. Today, a little bit better. It's not, um, it's not uh, much that uh, better. I think somehow people always think Chinese food should be cheap. When everything cheap, you... You don't get good ingredients, how you can produce good food. So that's, that's very hard. This is something, um, I, I have to say something about the fish. The movie Soul of a Banquet by Wang Wan Productions details Chan's early life in China, her family tragedy after moving to the U.S., and her experience as a businesswoman. Oddly enough, she never cooked until she was raising her two children with her husband and decided to open a restaurant in San Francisco. So always have something left. Yeah, I'm not cook at all. Then uh, after I came to this country, I of course cannot afford it to have a cook, so I started to learn how to cook, started with the rice making rice and uh, soup and then uh, cook uh, the milk for, to, uh, to my children. She said she never thought there would be a movie about her and her life, but her mission to educate the American public about Chinese food has been accomplished. Liu Wenwen, CCTV.